hello everyone welcome to my kitchen on my today's kitchen i will be showing you guys how i made this perfect cheese bread if you want to know how how i achieved this please guys stay tuned watch this video to the end and see how and the ingredients that i use to prepare this perfect and delicious and fantastic cheese bread so guys let's get started so guys in a bowl we are going to add all purpose flour i will add the sugar and salt so i'm going to add my powder mix and i will also add my eggs i'm using wet one guys you are free to use the dry yeast. Just mix everything together. Then the next thing we are bringing in, we have to bring in our warm milk. Warm milk, guys. Just pour it the warm milk. Then we will bring in one egg. Then the next thing is the granite oil. And we have to mix everything together and play with it at least for 10 minutes. So you just have to mash the dough. You can put it on the surface and work with it properly. The way I'm just doing it now, you need to play with the dough at least for 7 to 10 minutes until you get the tink and draw dough so i just rub the plate with the oil and my pan so you guys seen that when you press it will come back then you know you are you are good to go just cover it and we have to keep on a warm place for one hour or until the dough doubled in size so guys this is one hour later the dough have doubled in size so i just have to divide the dough and cut into pieces guys just as demonstrated on the video then i'm play with the dough just like that so this is what we are having then the next thing we have to do i'm going to be using cheese mozzarella cheese so meanwhile this is cheese pan guys cheese bread then i have to take one from that dough and just flat flat it this way as demonstrated guys i hope you guys are seeing it just flat it like this like so like so so let me show you guys how i make it so i just have to take my pizza cutter just start from the middle to the end but you have to leave some space in the end just like that just put in a line in the center of the flower so the, the next thing the space remaining on the top you just have to put your cheese there i'm using mozzarella cheese you can use chocolate you can use anything of your choice so just fold and pin it inside then you need to gum the edges to avoid losing so then after doing that just push from this con these edges and the other side break them then roll just like so very easy guys just roll like so yeah that is it guys you just have to pin it very well at the edges this is what we are looking for guys this is how it will look like just place on the other side then i will get another bowl to demonstrate it once more 
for you guys to see. If you cannot capture it, just replay. So that's just do the same and pull the sheets and fold it inside. I'm using the the part the slice ones. You can use the full sheets, just cut to your own shape and place it inside. You need to pin it very well to avoid losing. Then before you would roll, just like that. So you are going to repeat the same on the other ones. This is what we are looking for, guys. This is what we are looking for. And you guys see this? Look at how beautiful it is. So we are done, guys. This is what I have here. I just lay it on the baking pan. Then the next thing I'm going to cover for 20 minutes. After 20 minutes, I just break a yolk and add a little bit of water just to rub it, massage it to, to the bread. So then after that, I have to cover it for 10 minutes more before taking it to the oven. 